Dazzling Dream has just begun in Pokemon Go and it's actually quite nice to have an event start on a Saturday. Basically means I can actually get on top and make a video about it rather than doing it at the back end or at the end of the event. So nice one Niantic. Saturday event starts. I like it. So Dazzling Dream, what do we have? Well, we have some research to do. It's timed and as you can see i've already done some of it so we need to catch 20 fairy type pokemon we need to spin 20 stops that one is already completed i think that was something about stardust and hatch and egg we also have some collection challenges we have two in fact which are there one is all about what's that hatching so we're gonna have to hatch eggs and this one is about catching and evolving and we just need to catch a Swirlix and then do a couple of evolutions to complete that one. So, we need to spin one more Pokestop. We'll do this one here. There we go, that's that one done. We also need to catch one more Fairy type. And typically there is nothing about. Well done Waterfall for picking this start location. Never mind. We also need to try and track down the power up a pokemon 10 times task which will give us a chance and yes it is only a chance of getting the new shiny for this event which is cutie fly other mons that are rewarded from that task are i believe swirlix and spritzy so cutie fly is the chase so far in the last half an hour i've seen like two so hopefully they will be here soon i think i need to pop an incense cheap plug check out incense podcast new episodes drop every sunday and tomorrow we have special guest joe beats northerner from england twitch streamer and it's a good listen check that one out okay so right we need to drop an incense in fact let's just go daily adventure incense it's been a while since we've done one of those let's see if we can't get a well uh, at least a cutie fly but the shiny one would be nice. So we've got two eggs hatching. This should be the final thing that we need to do. Alolan Vulpix and Alolan Sandshrew. Great, there we go, but they are hatched. So now we can, well, we'll claim these rewards. These are, I think they're all hatching egg, which should be the Alolan Vulpix. I have checked so many stops and I cannot find the power of Pokemon 10 times task anywhere so don't know where they are they must be pretty darn rare so number two and the third one let's just check some of these not seen one of those shiny for a while still need a first shiny mortal no uh go on Meryl no no and uh, no okay let's claim our rewards dazzling dream fairy tale one of two we get a the cutie fly that's the new shiny it's not shine so far and considering that one of the bonuses for this event is stardust i probably should have dropped a star piece before i actually started today swirlix no we've still got the shiny one of those from go fest last year which i think will evolve later because i have never evolved swirlix number three gives us spritzy and finally for stage one we get the carbink. Now let's just claim the good stuff and move on to stage two. So two premium battle passes, a star piece and 3000 XP. And so stage two and 2000 starters, 3000 starters, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. So we need to earn 10K starters. I think we're going to drop a star piece and uh, hmm, the hatch challenge might take a while. So. I found two power up a Pokemon 10 times tasks. Now these will give me a chance at Cutie Fly. I did encounter quite a few Cutie Fly earlier, but none of them have been shiny. So let's have a look. Are we going to see the Cutie Fly shine? Well, that's a Spritzy. And second chance is, well, it is a Cutie Fly. It's not the shiny one, but hopefully we'll have some chances at the shiny cute flight with stage two of two. We've got, well, there's a lot there to go at. So we have got the cutie fly, Swirlix, Spritzy. We're getting one of each of the fairies here. So let's just see what's up next. Another cutie fly, another Spritzy. Let's see a pattern developing here. Another Spritzy. Last cutie fly check of this research. And it's not shiny. Swirlix. Spritzy. 
not shiny. Star piece. 6,000 XP, our hour, rewards, and finally an encounter with a carbink. Now, something that I said earlier. So this bad boy is one of the mons that is spawning for this event. And the little cappuccino fairy is pretty cute. We've got this one in Barcelona at the City Safari. And if I remember right, yeah, we have. We've actually done all of our little buddy treats, which is the, the prerequisite to evolve. Now, I've never evolved a Swirlix before, so <laughs> let's just get this out of the way. Get a shiny dex entry. So at least we've seen something shiny in this video because they're, they're not spawning at the moment. And there we go. <laughs> Look, Slurpuff. And that is, well, that's, that's a Mon. That is very, very interesting. And it looks great in the cappuccino colors. Now we also need to evolve a Clefable and a Wigglytuff. So, so we'll evolve our Clefairy into our Clefable and we'll evolve our Jigglypuff into Wigglytuff. So there's one collection challenge done, dusted and gone. We'll claim that in a second. The hatch challenge is gonna take a little bit longer. So I do need to work on that one, but at least one of the challenges is out of the way. So if we go in here, we can claim that first one, which will give us a reward of a thousand dust, 2000 XP and an encounter with another carbink. The hatch challenge is gonna take longer. We need to hatch a Togepi, a Spritzy, a Swirlix and a Cutie Fly. That could be interesting. We're gonna to have to burn through incubators. Don't know as I like that, but we've got a couple of checks here. Morlul still need that shiny. That one isn't shining. Uh, not an event spawn, Cub Chew, Maril. No, um, Fampy, not shiny, and Wisma, not shiny. And there we go, collection challenge is up to 135 on the badge. So that is the Dazzling Dream event. Not sure that I like some of the mechanics behind this event, but I will see you tomorrow for Hisuian Typhlosion Raid Day. Looking forward to that one. It's a pretty cool looking shiny and a couple of the crew are out and we're gonna be raiding that one. I definitely want those sparkles. So thank you very much for watching. If you do subscribe to this channel then thank you so very much. If you don't, please consider hitting that subscribe button down below. It's free, it will not cost you a penny. It really does help this channel to grow. Equally, if you are one of the people that support this channel through Patreon, Thank you so very much. It allows me to do just a little bit more with this channel than I otherwise would be able to. If you're interested in finding out how to support the channel, just click on the link in the description below. But that's gonna do it for this one. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Ian Waterfall and I'll see you in the next video tomorrow. Waterfall, out.